Okay, I just wanted to film a video explaining what I wanted to get up to you today. So, here it goes. Very basically, this was supposed to be a rest day, but I also planned rather spontaneously to do an EMOM 8 push up challenge for 10 rounds, and I did it slower than on the clock but I did do it I really pushed myself and that's not a bad thing as I'm implying in my mind is it shows that it's challenging and that I'd be reaching new levels with my exercise and perhaps my journey as a whole because of the mental battle that or of the perceived mental battle that came with doing that work it was a challenge for me no doubt I had to sort myself out and solve some problems like my wrist pain when doing the exercise because I had my hands on the mat rather than on the floor and also I don't want to wake anyone up the floor was creaking a whole lot due to the pressure I was putting on my wrists but I tried countering that wrist pain through placing more pressure on my fingertips however I with that being said, I want to make the exercise log relevant to this video. It's helped me think straight to be able to do the rest of what I want to do. So I want to keep on talking about that now. Okay, yesterday I said that I had someone to coach. I've got their session planned, ready to go, which I need to eventually do with them. I've even got their invoice ready to send to them. I made that yesterday, the day before, doing the session with this person so that once they have sent over the money, I can just immediately send over the invoice and it's not something I have to think about. Other than that, in terms of PT work, I'd like to set up my session with a case study of mine because we're still going through this um, this 12 week plan the schedules got messy we used to train like 2 to 3 times a week but because I don't want to work on um, certain days because I do deserve my rest it's meant that at least for now it just haven't been able to come together more than once a week however at least with the once a week sessions still working on it still working on case studies goals and you can use this as a starting point to then have more sessions with this person just because it might seem like things aren't looking up doesn't mean that things would stay that way if I let it I can work on it and then take it from there Anyway, um, other than that, when it comes to doing the course, I have uh, a whole load of session reviews that I want to put up, um, paste, that I want to copy and paste into the, the, um, the coursework that I'd have to send over. Speaking of, I could actually do that after filming this video, to be fair. Um, other than that, I don't know if I let myself rest. I plan to... I plan to go out and go explore. So, I'd be doing a lot of walking, but I wouldn't go out my way to go and strenuously Strenuous, strenuously exercise more than I already have done I didn't even use my full body weight when doing the push ups but for me that was a challenge enough as it is and that sort of stuff would get easier if I would keep doing it I want to even um, create a challenge to do for tomorrow because that was I, I did find that fun eventually I think I've set myself up 
in a more appropriate way mentally than I would do if I had just if I had just um, let myself go and leave so now it seems like doing what I truly want to do when I want to do is way more possible anyway um, I might exercise after training the people that I want to train this new person and someone that I've been working with for over a month now uh, I've got their session planned too I'm ready to go I planned that yesterday and I'll just try and go through the sessions for the both of them as quickly as I possibly can to give them as much bang for their buck as I can if they're paying me I may as well give them a good job may as well do it well but um other than that I don't think I've really planned to do much I've just used my diaries more effectively to be able to do what I truly want to do and I now have a much clearer idea of what I'd want to and what I wouldn't want to do in terms of what I plan to do to that hour because I spent quite a bit of time yesterday planning what I'd want to do to that hour or through time blocks anyway and um, it's helped me get it together for sure and I immediately realised how powerful that could be how powerful using a diary can be is very very strong I think because there's a lot I could be doing that I could just put into my diary and from there I could just make it happen rather than being purposeless like I said to myself the other day the same time I spend wasting away on YouTube is the same time that I could be making some money moves or rather to make that statement applicable to this situation is this, it's the same time that I could be using to really elevate my way of life and I think it's still true I still that said yesterday I let myself have a half day off and rest and just watch YouTube just for some entertainment but um, on the premise I don't let my waste look don't let myself waste away by doing that every day I'm fine with that just if I do it on rest days then or half days off then that's no problem not or at least not to me anyway I could take it from there by um, due to or through putting more of a um, boundary on when I would and wouldn't want to watch so but, um, yeah no that, that is right yeah so that's that that's a very basic overview of what I want to do I'm going to get up to it just need to make a start really that's it so on that note I'm done I'm going to get to doing what I plan to do today let myself have some fun that's it alright I'm done bye now I'm, after um, ending this clip I'm going to make some ideas for what I'd want to do for tomorrow's YouTube video alright peace I definitely want to keep up, hence I say that. Make me think straight today, so I want to keep that. Right, I'm done. Bye now.